What is going on guys? It's your boy Mike Day here with another LSPD FR episode. Uh, today we're doing another snow patrol up here in Blaine County. Uh, the last one was full of shootouts so hopefully we're going to mix it up a little bit. Uh, right now we are responding to a uh, traffic accident more than likely due to the weather. Um, we're going to go ahead and uh, see what's going on. Uh, we got a new car. Um, sorry, the self-driving uh, mode glitched out. Hybrid, you know. Um, future cars. So we're gonna go ahead and uh, pull up here. Um, don't really want to do anything, but we do want to let vehicles know. So we'll keep our uh, we'll go code two lighting. Hopefully get people to slow down. We'll back up a little bit. Uh, Paramax is already on scene, so... Uh, it looks like it's already being handled. Um, Alright. So we have a motorcycle. Looks like we have a hearse. Um, there's a wrecked bike over there. Alright, let's... uh see what's going on here. Who am I talking? Is it this guy I'm talking to? Or uh, someone over here I'm assuming. Alright, here we go. So uh, what's the situation? Alright, so essentially, uh, this was over speed. Um, this guy, who said he's a friend of the person who wrecked, um, Alright, so he's going to be on his way. We're going to go ahead and, uh, get his information just to be safe here. Um, we, we got his license already in the We're just going to check. He has nothing. Um, we're going to let him go. You know, he just, you know, technically got hit by someone and, uh, there's a little shaking up, so we'll let him go on the registration for now. If he gets pulled over later, uh, then he'll have to answer for it. No 1099s. Alright, uh. Go ahead and, uh, get a. Uh, tow truck out for this. I don't want to leave this guy's bike on the side of the road either. Um. A bob box truck. Probably. Apparently they have room for both of them. Um. Uh, We'll get another uh, box truck out here so we can uh, get this one towed. And then we're just going to go ahead and uh, code for this. Mm -hmm. You know, that's why a lot of people don't drive motorcycles in the winter, you know? Attention I mean, you got insurance on them and you could technically drive them all year round. I uh, actually knew someone who actually did drive a motorcycle and... Uh, you know, when I to get back and forth to work, freezing. I would not recommend it. Or, uh, sailing as well. The water is, uh, probably 10 times, if not 20 times colder in the winter than it is, uh, on land, just being by the water. Alright, so nice, easy call out. Uh, traffic accident, winter time, driving motorcycles. It's to be expected. I got the really nice uh, FPIS uh, for police interceptor going on. Uh, a lot of the features in this car. Go ahead here. I uh, will pull into the gas station. Uh, essentially, we have this. There's a dash cam actually on the back right there. Um, 
as well as we have a cam up here on the front uh, that records everything. I hear shots being fired. Attention, all units. We have a suspicious vehicle. It's kind of in the area I was thinking the shots are coming from. So uh, let's go ahead and uh, take that because there's definitely shots from somewhere. And that's a suspicious vehicle right there. People are reacting to shots being fired. Let's go ahead and check out this car. Well, this ain't the guy shooting. But he is scraping. What's he doing? We're not going to pull him over yet. Alright, yeah, we're, we are going to pull him over. He's on private property. Well, there's a... Uh, no plate for us to run. I mean, it's occupied times one. This ain't a road-worthy vehicle. Hey, sir, how's it going today? Hey, uh, do you work here? Uh, cause we got reports of, uh, you know, a person driving around. You ain't supposed to be here. Uh, you're the only one driving around. So I'm gonna first, uh, you know, can I get your license, please? Uh, you're still driving some sort of motorized vehicle here, and I'd like to know who I'm talking to. Uh, hang tight. We're gonna go back here, uh, check his information. Alright, so he's clean, no valid warrants or anything like that. Seems to be working. Uh, do you work here, sir? Uh, you don't have anything illegal? You don't have anything illegal, nothing. I can tell you that now. Alright, well, uh, you know, just uh, be safe. Stay warm. Uh, put a coat on. It's cold out here. So essentially, yeah, I mean, that guy, there's really nothing wrong. He's, uh. He's clear. Attention, all units. Officers report near Code 4. No there's still gunshots fired. being fired, and these people are reacting to gunshots. Where are they at? Whoa. Yeah, there they are. There they are. Attention all units. Assistance needed on a uh, Great Ocean Highway in Palato Bay. So, huh? Units respond code 3. Acknowledge. Around the gas station? Animals on the loose. Oh, this ain't good. Show me your hands right now. Drop the weapon. Drop it. Show me your hands. Drop it. Show me your hands. Look at this idiot. Stay down. Stay down. Stay down. There's another person. I don't know where he went. Good EMTs here. Attention all units. For this guy. In Palato Bay. Units reporting a pedestrian struck by a vehicle. An ambulance requested from a... Uh, no. We shot him, but, uh... Yeah. Um, We're is responding code three. There's a second guy. He is shooting at someone. We gotta find the second guy. And uh I'm just trying to look for people running. Essentially I mean there's so many hiding spots. Guy's wearing a hoodie, I mean, shorts, but that doesn't really. We don't have a description of the guy that we're looking for. So, fortunately, the other units didn't get there in time. 
we're gonna go ahead and reduce code um, and hopefully they'll show back up that's about all we can do Uh, this is really nice. I really love this uh, paint job as well on the car. It's probably uh, one of my new favorites. And uh, this car seems to be working fine for a Ford. Um, we'll let that officer handle that uh, traffic stop. Um, I was going to go around him. I was like, no. We'll let that officer handle that traffic stop and. Uh, Let's see what we get. Disregard. Alright, so. Drug overdose and then a disregard followed. So, uh. We don't have to go to that one. Attention, all units. We have a traffic alert in Del Perro. Units respond code 3. I was hanging around the police station earlier. We should uh, probably go question that guy. <laughs> Citizens report a 148 on um, Great Ocean Highway. Uh, according to uh. This patch, it looks like it's right there, actually. Okay, huh? Backup needed. Attention, uh, this was easy. They got themselves stuck. Holy shit. Uh, of course, he's gonna run up the damn hill. Uh, I don't see a gun. There's rocks and everything. He fell, he fell. Give it up. Give it up. Don't move. Don't move. Just give it up. Give it up. Come on. Go underground. Don't even. Alright, um. Snow must be deep here. <laughs> there it is. Bernard. All right, why why'd you run, man? Stupid! I know you jacked the truck, but I mean, where were you gonna go in shorts? You would have died before you got anywhere. Here, you got any weapons or anything? Anything that's gonna stick, poke, or hurt me? Uh, let's. Uh, I'm gonna do the pat down. Quick and uh, phone small photo. Um, Alright, looks Except like the other unit. Be careful, be careful. That's gonna be a little slippery. That looks like the other unit already uh, got the tow truck out for a money truck. So we're going to be code for there. We're just gonna have to get a transport for, uh, this guy. And we'll, uh, We'll wrap this one up. Go ahead, sit, hop in, sit in the back of my car. Uh, yeah, it's a slight, very slight clipping issue. Um, but overall, it's a really nice car. Although this side's perfect, so that works out. Just that one corner. All right, we'll go ahead and reduce code. Let people know who's coming down the road that we're here, and uh, it's a. Uh, Hop in for a transport. Let's see what else we can get ourselves in today. And... Eh, what's going on, deputy? Yeah, I got this guy. Stolen money truck job. Give him credit for trying. Hey, thanks for a transport. Wait for uh, this deputy to get it resolved. 
before we go ahead and uh, take our coat off here. Alright, she's in her car, so we're good. Hey, dispatch, show us 10 8. We are available for calls. Lincoln, 18. Nope. We have a 1099 in, uh, Paleto Forest. Copy that. Moving right now. Roger that. Alright, we're gonna go ahead and, uh, units calling for backup. Go ahead and get out here as quickly as possible. And uh, the deck hop just steal the guy's bike. What is that officer doing? We're gonna go ahead and pull him beside this guy. Don't really want to get on the road here. We'll go ahead and get a corner out. Wonder if this guy has any ID. Jesse Miller. Alright. I don't know what those sheriff's deputies uh, are doing with their car, but uh, alright. We're gonna hang tight here and uh, out of curiosity. Suspended license. He's not wanted. He's only been stopped three times, so. Report shot fired in Strawberry. Uh, so the officers probably, since we're so close, is going to take that vehicle back to the station. And, uh, we're going to call it Herda Mountain Lion. Don't want anyone to get hurt by that thing. This is a more uh, calm, what you might actually typically find uh, in the country. Not so much as far as the sh gang shootings every two seconds when you turn around. A lot of traffic uh, today, especially in the winter, is to be expected. As well as some uh, occasional things that come up. But don't know exactly what happened with that last stop, why that guy would have uh, done what he did. But, uh, you know, when you're dealing with the country... Yeah, people tend to have more guns than what they actually do in the city. It's more common to find people carrying shotguns, snipers, and everything. It's just because, you know, you got the open land naturally go hunting and everything. Versus in the city, you don't find, you know, people walking around with a sniper rifle with their yacht six or anything like that. So it's definitely a different environment. Attention all units. We've got citizens report. And, uh, another car accident. So we're going to go ahead and, uh, head up to this car accident and see what we got going on. Try to ease our way through the, the different intersections.
Um. Not seeing anything. None of these pools are really broken. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, walk over here. Make sure no one slid over the hillside or anything like that. Hmm. Well, either someone uh, got hit and ran or uh, it's a false alarm. Hey, ma'am, you see any? Or, not ma'am, sorry, sorry. You see anything today? Any signs of a car accident or anything around here? No? Alright, thanks for your time. Alright, so we're going to have to sum this one up as a false alarm. False report. There it is. Checked with someone who was standing on their porch enjoying a smoke or a drink. I'm not sure. Uh, but they were just still on the porch. They didn't see anything. And, uh, no signs. And... So we're going to just march up as a false, not a hit and run or anything like that. And, uh... Our, uh, faithful postal workers. You know what, we're going to swing back around real quick and, uh... I mean, it's cool down here. That guy's been... Staying at the station front doors for a while now. Hasn't went in. So uh, it's just interesting. Hey bud, how's it going? Deputy Day here with the Lane County Sheriff's Department. How soon does it be this year? Is it uh, not letting me uh, mark him? Oh, there we go. Up, cream pie, right now. It seems, hey. Hey. What seems, oh shit. Seems ah. to be the issue. Suspicious that Terry. I'm just gonna try to stop him oh, real quick. Your head off. Um. Citizens reporting a criminal resisting arrest on, um, Great Ocean Highway. Hey, watch it. Hello there. Well, I want to say that's glitching out. There's been a lot of stolen money trucks, so today is the day of the stolen money truck. It's like the third or fourth one I've seen show up on the scanner. Just a ton of stolen money trucks. We'll let Michael go. Um... Let him go. Oh shit. My uh, reckless driving. They are... You alright, bud? Ocean 1, we can get that. Oh, huge 1050. Huge... Shit. Oh, thank God they had my back. He, uh, I don't even know how he managed to get up after getting hit by a car with a gun. I'm gonna take the gun. Hey, hey, back up. Back up. Well, uh, and here we go. We're gonna let them deal with it. They were the lead unit. <laughs> They're the lead unit. They can deal with it. 
Lincoln, 18. We have a stolen police vehicle in Palato Bay. Yep, there I go, kind of cross the roads with uh, no lights. Yeah, we only got a few cars to begin with, so the fact that you're gonna steal a cop car is uh, just ridiculous. Okay, there's support out here, uh, especially since it's uh, someone daring enough to steal a cop car. It's uh, pretty brave. Trying to go for a pit here. He's uh, fighting it. I mean, we're at slow speed, so. Got a pit. Show me your hands. Show me your hands right now. Get down. Get down. Don't even do it. Just get down. Don't move. All right, Leo. You got anything on you that's gonna stick, poke, or hurt me? I found. Why'd you steal a cop car, man? Was it worth it? Hop in my car. Do a nit check on him real quick. License is suspended. Hmm. Attention all units. We have security detail requiring assistance in Palato Bay. We're gonna go ahead and we'll have an officer go grab that car. It's right across the street. We don't need a tow truck. I'll just drop this guy off. That's gonna go move it, but uh... I'll let someone know in the station when I'm in there. They can go grab it. It's right across the street. Hey, but there's a, another sheriff's unit across the street if you want to pick it up. This guy stole it. And uh, with that, we are going to be code 4 off of that. Another successful patrol. Uh, can't beat that. Thanks for tuning in. Uh, if you like it, if you got any suggestions, I'm always looking for improvements. Uh, please be sure to leave a comment let me know what you think uh, reviews are welcome especially if they uh, help improve the channel as well be sure to hit the like button and hit the subscribe button so you never miss an LSPDFR upload it's been fun it's your boy Mike Day thanks for watching see ya